What's up guys, Manic Park Fan 1 here, and today I've got a special, special review sort of tutorial for playing games on a, on a non-jailbroken iPhone, iPad, iPod, whatever you've got. Uh, it works with, I think, 4.3 and over, and above, above, sorry, and I all the way to iOS 7, beta... What is it? Beta 6? Beta 6 or Beta 5? Beta 6, Beta 6. It's called Remote File Manager, I think. Let me just check that on. Remote File Manager. And uh, basically lets you play SNES games, Super Nintendo games. I will demonstrate this to you. First off, go get this app right here, Remote Files. It's 99 cents if you think it's worth the pay. Or, well, 99 cents and uh, well go pay it go go buy it and uh, definitely if you want to play games snes games on a non jailbroken iphone ipad whatever uh, like me you're in if you're like me and you've got ios 7 any beta and you miss your old jailbroken apps um, maybe snes emulators basically SNES emulators is the only thing we can emulate right now with this app but if you're like me you want an alternative that works with both jailbroken and non jailbroken so this only costs you 99 cents think about that I I I consider it worth it I really do and uh, <laughs> with what it does it's worth it. I swear it's it's completely worth it. Well, let's get to the tutorial. Let's go to Safari after you've downloaded the app and go to coolrum coolrum.com. And uh, from there, uh, click wait, let me just back up from here. You will be greeted with this screen. It will say rom files tutorials, emulators, and you press or tap on ROM files and go all the way down until you see Super Nintendo. And from there just choose I want Zelda. Zelda is my absolutely favorite SNES game. Here it is. Zelda Link to the Past. My favorite game and scroll down until you see download click on it click on it not hold just click on it once and it reloaded sorry click on it once it will start downloading and you will be shown this screen this screen will be on this will be your screen basically and then you tap on open in and now scroll until you see drop now here I need to pause because obviously I don't want to see I don't want you to see my password so I'll be back. Okay, so now I'm back. You will be greeted with this screen. It says cancel and save. You obviously will click on save. And I already have it so I'll override it. And now we're done. Now you can go to your home screen. Go to remote files manager or file manager and click on your Dropbox name scroll all the way down and you'll see Zelda a link to the past you'll see this click the .smc file and BOOM ha Hyrule we're coming to save you and now the controls are, are okay actually they're not bad they're not terrible could be improved yes but I mean, what what do you expect? It's it's 99 cents, and obviously it's it's not accepted by Apple, obviously. But well, this is um, this is obviously not an a a thing Apple noticed once they were reviewing it. But obviously, you have to do this right now because I. I assure you, within this week, this will be 
this will no longer be in the app store so I do recommend that you go and get it now no that's I don't really oh my god the story is so long oh well the intro the beginning is long um, but yeah I, I'm playing a SNES game on an on a jail on jailbroken non jailbroken iPad running iOS 7 so I'm thankful for that actually and once you have it I recommend you you back it up back the API up to do that just go to iTunes download it from iTunes and then just drag the file to your desktop or whatever and just make it a sip just in case I, I always do that with with these kind of rare apps just because it Apple will remove them at any given time so might as well okay so yeah thanks for watching this was Magic Park Fun 1 and I will see you later peace out